So, what's going on everybody? It's Rec here, and welcome to Feed the Beast. Yes, Mr. Sheep, that's exactly what we're doing. Do you think that's a fun idea? Well, nobody asked you. Anyways, I decided I wanted to do a Feed the Beast series because I thought that would be fun. Uh, I got myself this world that I spawned in, and I decided, you know what? This looks as good of a world as any to be in, so let's get started. I'm going to go ahead and run into this chest and grab ourselves a bunch of things. I'm going to take all these torches in the chest, too. Yeah, chest. Boosh, boosh, and boosh. And then we are going to go chop down this tree. This should probably take a while. Ugh. <sighs> I plan on editing this part out, so whatever I say here doesn't really matter. I'm probably going to have to edit this very heavily as I think about it. Oh well, not the biggest deal. Alright, now that we have taken down that tree, it's time to start finding a way to get down underground. Uh, are there any caves nearby? No, but anyways, I hate caves, so we're not doing that anyways. Uh, woo like spike right there. And I'm going to apologize for the frames. Uh, my computer doesn't like Feed the Beast very much, so yeah. I'm also playing on short render distance, and hello, village! You did not know you were there. Well, this makes it a lot easier. Uh, also, I'm running the Direwolf 20 pack, because that's the one I like the most, and ooh, we got some uh, good options here. No tool rods. We need tool rods. Knife blade. Copper sword blade could use one of those. Uh, we will get to those later, though. But uh, it's glad to know we have a village here. That's always useful. All right, let's go check out the other houses. That's that. That's not anything interesting. There's a villager here. He wants to... Okay. Uh, we will be able to do a lot of things to begin with, then. Another house right here. Are you a... Th uh, yes, you are a Tinker's uh, guy. Ooh, I can buy aluminum or berry bushes from you. You are very useful to me. Uh, big house. Big house right here. Oh, it's a mistcraft house. This is amazing. And let's see. Tiger biome. What's this a page for? This is a page for a Tiger Hills as well. And, uh, yeah. Pretty interesting, I'd say. Got some bookcases around here. Let's see. Anything else? Because uh, I would like for there to be more than just that. Because that's not much stuff. Uh, nope, that's it. Well, this is where we're setting up anyways, because I can't be bothered to find a place to build and live in. We have sheep. There's a well, so that might actually mean there's more down here. Um, no, nothing down there whatsoever. So, let's go ahead and take over... I don't know. Oh, you're a bit trapped in there, aren't you? There you go. You're free to go. Oh, yep, you want, or you want me to sell me melons. That's the word I was looking for, melons. Uh, and sell. Those were the words I was trying to say. But I couldn't say them because, I don't know. Uh, you're the barricade guy. I'll probably trade with you a lot. Alright, we're going to go set up in this uh, tinker's house right here. Uh, except for there's no entrance into the house. Um, yeah. He's kind of trapped in there. We'll leave him in there. We'll actually go set up in here. And for the time being, we're also going to put uh, that out there, because I don't want him escaping. Now, let's set ourselves up a chest. And I'm going to go ahead and get some basic infrastructure built up real quick. Alright, I got a few things set up here. We have ourselves a nice little bed. We have ourselves some uh, Tinker's Construct stuff, which I honestly just went and stole from uh, one of the houses down there. And uh, we're going to free this guy up so I can actually go and grab his stuff. Are you going to move out of the way, or am I... Yeah, I'll just push you out of the way. All right. Uh, what do you have in here? Ooh, is that an iron pickaxe head? Yes, it is. Uh, we can get ourselves a paper binding. Ooh, that is very fancy. And we're also going to jump up to here real quick. And uh, was there a tool rod in here? I do not believe there was. But I should have a tool rod. I stole the wool from here, by the way. Uh... Yeah, no tool rod. A uh, couple things are stuck in here from when I put them in there. Uh, but I think we will take the... Uh, oh, no. I don't really... We'll figure out the weapon later. Ooh, there's a slime pickaxe head as well. But that'll be incredibly slow and we don't want that. Wait. Oh, look, another iron pickaxe head. Perfect. That's that as well. Slime binding. 
Uh, well, let's go get ourselves a... Whatchamacallit? A tool rod. We'll just make it out of probably just wood. That'll be the easiest thing. Actually, I can just use a stick. That'll work perfectly. Why do I have so many sticks? Who knows? Uh, nope, that's not it. I need the tool station. I need to make myself a pickaxe. And we are going to make ourselves that with a paper binding with a tool rod. And we are going to have ourselves... Da 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 da! Basic pick! I spelled basic, right? Yes, I did. But I need to actually put a K there. You know, for added flair, we'll make that a capital K. Basic pick! Perfect. And we will go ahead and store our, uh, thing in here. And then what we can go do is we can start mining. Huzzah. And we'll just, uh, put all these things out here. And we'll put that there. We'll bring this as our weapon for the time being. We'll bring that with us. You know, what's the, uh, what's the durability on this thing? 250. Not bad. Not bad at all. And I can repair it with, uh, iron. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna start mining. I will turn this house into a mining house. So, yeah, let's do this. I have found myself a nice vein of, uh, coal. Coal? What is coal? Coal. Coal here, and I'm just gonna mine this up, and then we're gonna resume. Oh, but wait a second. It's Sirtis Quartz. Haha. -ha. That is incredibly useful. We're not gonna need it this very second, but it's still incredibly useful. Alright, back to digging. Well, we have found ourselves a few order uh, infused stone, which is for Thalmcraft, which I haven't said this yet, but I really want to to begin with. Uh, I really want to start with Thalmcraft very early on, because this uses the newest version of Thalmcraft, which has the new research mechanic and all that, and I really want to get into that to begin with, because it looks like a lot of fun. And uh, yeah, that's basically it for that. There's also more coal here. And also a little bit higher up, I found myself some cinnabar and some entropy shards. So we have a bunch of stuff already, which is good. All we need now is some uh, gold, and we should be able to start Thumbcraft. Ooh, an aluminum. Nice. Oh, and some Chimerite for Ars Magica. I also want to get into Ars Magica fairly fast as well. I want to do magic. Magic's fun. Anyways, uh, going to continue mining. Be back again later. Well, this is definitely useful. We found ourselves some tin ore already. I was not expecting to find any, because I think I was too low for it, but, eh, not gonna complain. We need this junk, eventually. Not anytime soon right now. Ooh, and more coal. Finding lots of coal today. Alright, be back again. Alright, so we have made it back to the surface. We are gonna go ahead and run into our house and sleep real quick so all of our villagers don't die. Of course there's monsters nearby. Where are the monsters? I don't want them- nope, get out of here. You are not killing the villagers. Uh, yes, also, there's morph, so I become a zombie. I don't know if it's... Yeah, okay, good, I don't become him by default. That's an annoying thing. Uh, okay, can we sleep now? Yes, we can. Great. Now, I've picked up a few things for my mining trip here. Let's, uh, click this chest so we can put things away. We got ourselves some more Sirtis. So some Amber. I hear a zombie burning outside. I want to go kill him real quick. Because we can't have him chasing down our... Villagers. There we go. Yeah, I saved probably one, maybe. I don't even know. Some of them might have died. Who knows? I don't care. Uh, what I really need to do is I need to get some dank food, because I am a uh, bit out of food. Did I get any food from this? No. Okay, anyways, I got real co er, cobblestone. I got myself some chimerite, aluminum, order shards, entropy shards, cinnabar, iron, which is what I was needing, because I wanted to get started with Thumbcraft very fast. So we are going to go ahead and pretty much rush into this. We're going to make ourselves a furnace. And we'll just stick that on top of our crafting table for now. And we'll put in that. We'll put in one of those. And we'll let that run. Uh, I can also get some of this. I'd like all my sticks, but I'm going to use one for my... Uh, whatchamacallit? Magic wand. I'm going to put up all these things. And I'm going to make myself some more sticks, because I'm going to need them. Uh, we have Peridot, which is... You know, not really used for anything else besides... If I just click U right on it. We can use it to make ourselves some tools. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Now, we can make ourselves a Peridot Sword. Might be useful. Uh, yes, Peridot Sword. We can make ourselves a Peridot Axe. So we have that. And we will get ourselves a Peridot Shovel. Like so. And we should have our iron being done cooking up, mostly. Great. So we'll take that out. We'll put that in there. We need to make ourselves two sets of these iron nuggets, because 
it's a bit of a pain because you need that many. And we'll make ourselves two iron caps. We'll get rid of all that. We'll make both of these. No, I have to go this way, I think. And that, and we should get ourselves a iron capped wand. And what we can do is we can just click a bookshelf. And boom, we have ourselves a Thaumonomicon. And now it has all this information that we need on Thumbcraft. Which I do believe there's also a Thaumic Tinkerer here. Yes, so we'll have a lot more fun stuff to do as well. Alright, we're going to go ahead and put this up for now, though, because we don't need it. We're not uh, dealing with that at the moment. Now, my quick question is, can I repair basic pick... Oh, no, with iron. I sh iron ingots, I should be able to, I think. Yes, perfect. There we go, basic pick has been repaired, so we can put that up in there. And I need to make myself some... Alright, I'll put that up also. We'll put that there. Nope, that there would be better. That there, and we need some more wood, because we need to make ourselves some torches. So let's do that real quick. Just make a bunch of them, and that way we'll never run out. I also need to get myself some food still, because, uh, no food. As you can see, my hunger bar is slowly going to kill me, so... Yeah, we'll see what we have in terms of, uh, food for right now. We'll go around and we'll bash some of these. Maybe we'll get some food. I can't eat violets, because those are plants, or flowers. But you can eat plants, not flowers, though. Uh, alright. It's a river biome, mountain biome. There's some sand over there. But, oh, I need food. Come on, break into something that I can eat. Please. Please, please, please. Alright, well, I'll be back once I have some uh, options for food. Alright, so my foraging has only yielded me a uh, few seeds, but I should be able to make our, myself, myself, that's the word I was looking for, myself, a basic farm that I guess I can wait on to get some uh, food. Sad thing is, though, I don't have enough iron for a bucket. I have two iron only, which isn't good. And I'm also low on health, so I'm going to have to go back down to the mine, which that's not going to be fun at all. Not amber, I don't need amber, I need this. One, two, no, just two. And I need to make myself a hoe. But yeah, I need to go back down into the mine to go find anything. Uh, oh wait, I know one thing I can do for some slight food, at least. We'll get ourselves uh, that. And we can go ahead and we'll turn those into slabs, like so. And then we'll take those slabs and we'll do that. Nope, come on, let's put them up here, because that makes more sense. And we get ourselves a couple drawing racks. And what we can do is we can hang these up here. We can take ourselves a couple pieces of rotten flesh. And we can put them up there. Perfect. So those things will dry and they will turn into monster jerky. Which is not a very good food source, but it's still a food source. And so I'd very much like to have that. So let's head down here real quick. And we're going to go ahead and set up a tiny little farm. Which is village. It started with a farm, but sadly it didn't. So, don't have much other an option besides building our own farm down here. And we'll just, like, set it up in the water. Because why not? That makes sense, right? Alright, that's uh, all we really need space for anyway. So, we'll get ourselves some of those. And we'll plant down some wheat. And this one cotton seed that I got. It's not going to give me any food. But it's still a cotton seed nonetheless, and cotton is useful later on because you can get more, uh, whatchamacallit, string and wool from it. That's the words, not whatchamacallits. Now, there's clay down here, I'm sure. We will need to get clay later on when we want to get into Tinker's Construct, and I'm actually going to grab this right here. A bit of copper. That's going to be useful. Is there one more in there? No. Okay. Uh, I believe there was a tree up there, yeah, but that's a bit of a pain to get to. Sugarcane! That is incredibly useful. We are going to go there and we're going to grab a bunch of that. More coal. Uh, I'm not going to grab the coal because it's kind of useless at this point. There's Certus, though. Quartz. Certus Quartz. And I will want that because you can never have enough of that stuff. We're just going to set up our uh, sugarcane out here. We'll come back for it later. Don't worry. We're not going to just leave it there. That'd be just weird to do. Uh, okay. Let's get this up here. We're gonna chop down, get this, punch, punch, punch with my pick, get ourselves some Certus. Now, is there a rubber tree up here? Because one of those would be incredibly useful. I might chop down some of these uh, oak trees as well to hopefully get an apple out of them. 
because apples are, uh, you know, they're a food source, and that would be very, very useful. Okay, yeah, these are just oak, and holy cow, that is scary looking. Alright, let's just uh, chop down this real fast, because I don't want to be <laughs> involved in this, or be anywhere near this area, really. Cause you saw those mobs over there. It's not going to be fun if I get stuck with them. Uh, come on, come on, leaves, come on, break, please, hurry. I'm gonna help these guys out. And before you say it, punching leaves does not hinder the drop rate. They still drop the same. So, you guys can just hush. But I need to get these. Hopefully I can get an apple. And then I have to run back and sleep. Actually, a sapling would be very useful, because then I can just farm these. Oh, I should have made myself a uh, sickle so I can 